Trekia versus Takie. Game ends 2-1 to Takie and Takie are now in the round of 16. This game was insane. This game had 18 yellow cards in it. It had two red cards, one after the game, one in the 20th minute when Barak received his second yellow card and was given his matching orders, early shower time. And yeah, Czechia had to play the rest of the game, basically 60 minutes with 10 men. And they did well to actually get an equalizer. Um, of course, Hakan Chalanolu had gotten the lead for Takie, captain leading from the for, for the front. I feel like many captains have scored in this tournament. Um, yeah, so the ball came to, was it Kinan Yilmaz? I don't say Yilmaz. I I forget his name. I, for, I keep for confusing Yildiz and Yilmaz. Yeah, Kinan Yilmaz. So Kinan Yilmaz, ball comes to him, shot is blocked and falls to Hakan Chalanolu, who takes a smart position in the box and he manages to just bury it in the corner to give Takie a 1-0 lead against a uh, Czechia team that, uh, to be honest, really didn't do much. Um, they they, they, they kind of had that. They didn't do much in this game, to be, let's just be honest. But they were a bit, they had a bit of a, they were a bit on the front foot just before the red card, and after that it was just Takie the rest of the half. Second half started, it was Takie still. Um, then th- sometime in the second half, they started getting the ball a bit more, they made a few changes actually, which really helped them. Uh, Matei Kovar, Thomas Churi, and Jan Kukta, I believe that's his name. The three of them really changed them. They just gave them more energy because fatigue is becoming a factor, right? And to that spell of pressure, they had a throw in. Then the ball is thrown in by Vlad- Vladimir Sufal. Long throw, set piece <laughs> specialist, Western player. And the ball comes in, and then Chori is basically fighting with the goalkeeper. I don't know how that was all given as a foul to the goalkeeper. They even went to VR to check, but they still gave it. And anyway, he bullies the goalkeeper, finally has a shot. Uh, the shot is blocked. He swings his foot back, almost hits the goalkeeper's head. Um, but the ball comes to Suchek, and Sufal's West Ham teammate buries it in the top corner to give uh, Czechia a 1-1 um, an equalizer to make it 1-1. And at that point, I was like, wow, where have these guys come from? Where have these guys come from? And Taki were almost assured to go through, right? Um, I mean, going one nil up, they were going to be second in the group and automatic qualification. But this one just really pulled them back. And considering how emotional the game was, like it was not a tidy game after that. It was just it was just back and forth, right? 18 yellow cards. Uh, Chalanulu got a, a yellow card for trying to argue with the ref because he really thought there was a yellow card that was warranted there. Um, but yeah, he, he the goal, the, the goal, the goal, the, wow, the goal stood at 1-1. Um, then yeah, Cheng Tosun came in the 75th minute. He, yeah, brought on a presence up front. Um, Kokchu as well, who I thought would start the game in the prediction, I predicted he needed to have a big game. Uh, he came on for Haka and he didn't start this game and he managed to get an assist for Cheng Tosun. Again, another striker coming on for another late goal. Another late goal from a super sub in the 95th minute, Cheng Tosun. So actually it was a Czech uh, free kick. So they kick it long, but guys are just tired. So one header brings it back and they just can't run. They can't run. This time Taki are sending like five people towards Czechia's goal. Finally, the ball lands to Cheng Tosun on the wing um, up from a coach pass and he just cuts back and slots it to the bottom corner to give Takie a 2-1 win, a last minute win. There was another record after the game. It got a bit feisty. People were fighting. Fans, some fans read running onto the field, but they were stopped by the stewards. Um, but that's how the game ended. Game ended 2-1. And that means Takie now have six points in the group and then tied with Portugal, but the Portugal already had secured top spot. So Takie in second position in Group F and qualify for the round of 16. And uh, I'll let you know who they're playing shortly. So, yeah, that's it for the group stages of Euro 2024.